and welcome to DTW GED Prep Welcome. In today's video, we're going to find how to get the total surface area of a rectangular prism. Okay, so this is a rectangular prism. All right, I've done earlier on a video on the volume of rectangular prism. Now this is um, the surface area of a rectangular prism. So our question here says, determine the total surface area of a rectangular prism with the following dimensions, length this, breadth this, and height this. Now the formula to get the surface area of a rectangular prism, I'm using the formula from the GED math formula sheet, so you can download yours. I'll leave the link in the video description box of this video. Okay, so it's, it's proper, you, you know, you, for geometry, you follow the GED formula sheet, not just any random textbook, because the variables used might be different, and you might get confused when you see, uh, you know, when you see on the GED test on the formula sheet a different letter, while on your textbook you've learned something else. Okay, so it's better you download this and follow it. Okay, that's what I'm following. So the, to find the a surface area of rectangular prism, the formula is what 2 LW, that's length and width, 2 times length and width plus 2 LH plus 2 WH. So L is what the length, H is height, W is width, and this is height. From here, we know our length, we know our breadth, we know our height. From our, uh, um, most times, the question might not just be in text form, it might just be a diagram. So you have to figure out which is the height. So this is the height. When you have a rectangular prism, from here to here is the height, while from here to here, the longer part is the width. Okay, while the shorter part is what, uh, sorry, is the length, while the shorter part is what, the width. Okay, that's how you know it. Okay, and the height is this perpendicular line here. This is the height, our length and width, okay? So that's, if there's no text, you're just giving a diagram with no figures on the diagram. So here we get two, what is L? L is what, eight. So two in parentheses, let's put parentheses, eight times, what is our width? Our width is the same as what the breadth. So five plus two, parentheses, eight times our height is seven plus two in parentheses, uh, let me put this down here. The width is five times seven, okay? So here we get, this will be two times, eight times five is 40 plus two, eight times uh, seven is 56 plus the 5 times 7, what's 5 times 7? That will give us 35, right? So this times this will give us 80. In this in this questions, you always allow to use your GD calculator. So you can always bring it up for all this, you know, complex multiplications, okay? And 70. So when we add up all this, we're going to get what? 262, okay? And, you know, this is, in, this is area. So our uh, unit of measurement will be what? In square inch inches okay so square inch so this is our final what um, answer for this question all right so our height is seven right length eight and the uh, width is five okay let me just put this here okay so thank you for staying tuned to dtwgd prep okay please don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel you can also check our website for summary notes on your social studies, science, sciences, study guides, free practice uh, questions on math, your GED formula sheets. You can also join our Facebook group, over 11,000 members in the group to support you, to know about the GED in your area, any questions you have about the GED, um, the group is there to support you. You can also um, contact me if you require private one-on-one -on -one tutoring. I offer that. I'll leave all my details, the links, useful resources for you. I'm going to leave them in the video description box of this video. 
All right. Thank you so much for staying tuned. And finally, don't forget that Jesus Christ is coming soon. Give your life to Christ, for he is the way, he is the truth, he is the life. He is the one who is going to lead you to heaven at last, give you that life of peace, joy, love, and sound mind here on earth. And, you know, provision, uh, uh, preserve you and protect you, divine protection. All right, His everything is in him, everything, all the answers in life is in Christ. All right, he's waiting for you. So thank you for staying tuned and see you in our next video.